sugar is intrinsically inflammatory and it's not your friend and you have to process it. When you say that, do you differentiate between natural sugars and processed sugar or raw sugar? Like when you say sugar, are you talking about what's in a watermelon for, or what's in a Coca-Cola? Yeah, that's such a great question. So the so let's talk about all of it. So yeah. let's first talk about added sugars. Okay. So Coca-Cola. Uh, I'm sure I'm going to hear Coca-Cola plants like right across the street from me. And I always am like, oh, hi, I'm not visiting you. Uh, but so, okay, added sugars. Coca-Cola, can and Coca-Cola, I believe, has 39 grams of sugar in it. And the RDA, the recommended daily allowance for sugar, is 40 grams. So if you drink a can of soda. You're it you're it, like you reached it, right? But that doesn't leave any room for the natural, no non-added sugars. You, you've essentially used up your chit in a Coke, which yeah. to me doesn't really seem worth it. Um, now, when you're drinking that, you're also getting artificial colors, artificial flavors, preservatives. So you're not just getting the sugar. So you're getting a whole host of things that really don't belong in your body and your liver has to process. Okay, so I would say that's probably, a. am a pretty straight up, don't drink your calories kind of human. I do put electrolytes in my water. It's 25 calories. It's derived from coconut. It's natural, right? It's like, it, we're not talking about fake. It's it's You can actually trace the source of what it is. So that doesn't, 25 calories doesn't bother me in the course of like my 1500 calorie day. But then let's take the next cut of it. Uh, cake, candy, cookie, bread, pasta, processed food. Because it's processed, it converts very quickly and easily into sugar. So anything or has high levels of sugar in it in order to make it fluffy or tasty or dessert-like. So these are also areas you want to be really careful of. You know, in like the 1820s, people ate the amount of sugar in a year that we eat in a day. That is so wild. I know. That's like the fun, the crazy, creepy fun fact. So <laughs> people used to eat 40 grams of sugar in a year. Wow. And we eat 40 grams of sugar in a day. Uh, those Dunkin' Donuts, you guys, do you guys have Dunkies out West? We do. Yeah. Okay. So Dunkin' Donuts, those frozen things, the, the, like a, it's like a Frappuccino sort of, it's like their version of a coffee drink. They have a whole bunch of cool drinks and, and, you know, they're frozen and they're sweet and they have like a hundred grams of sugar in them. Wow. I know. So these are, and, and it's invisible, right? We're just like, oh, I'm just getting a drink. I'm just getting a coffee drink. It, it's fine. Well, yeah. it's just, I only do it once a week. And I'm like, I'm at Dad. the airport. It's okay. I need a treat. Yeah. It's the things we tell ourselves. So these things are pretty insidiously nasty. We just don't recognize how bad it is for us. And they're like, why don't we feel well? There's a lot going into that.